to my channel. And if you're new, stopping by for the first time, welcome. My name is Laura, and today I'll be sharing a Dollar Tree haul with you all. So I was so excited to find these. They're getting a lot of different clothing at, at my Dollar Tree. Look how cute this is. Isn't that adorable? For, I mean, for a dollar, it's got the white trim. I just think it's so cute. And it's a it's a one size, so uh, our little grandson uh, needs to get a little bigger to fit into this one. But I just thought it was so, so cute. So pretty. And it's so soft pretty. It's not pretty. It's cute. <laughs> and then I got these. These are one size two, it says. But this is more like uh, what he can wear now, like a newborn, you know, one month, two months. So I got two of those. But I mean, they're getting so many new clothing at the Dollar Tree, it's amazing. And then I have hauled, I think it's this one. Um, I did pick up another one because there was still some left. I don't think um, people are realizing that they're not just the normal t-shirts that um, the Dollar Tree carries. These are Hanes and look how cute that is if you haven't seen that already on one of my hauls. So, so cute. And then they have the V-neck, which I real I thought was really nice. Um, I would I prefer the V-neck over you know the crew neck. So I did pick up two of the V-neck t-shirts for myself. You know, just thought it's summertime and nice and cool. So I got two of those. And then look at this one. This was just like the only one in the stock pile there, um, and I thought that was really cute. So I picked up that. I mean, I had to dig. There was so many clothes, um, so many shirts, and you know the 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 onesies were all together. But it was there was just so much at my store. And then look, I found the the I, the uh, what is it called? When life gives you lemons, make lemonade. But this is not microfiber. So these are the kind I enjoy. The microfiber gets stuck on my you know my dry hands and I don't like the feeling so if I get those they're just for decoration I don't like to use them so anyway so so pretty and then I did find the pot holder I think it fell on the floor um where'd it go oh it didn't here it is something else fell on the floor oh I picked up two of those so I got two of the the towels and then I got the pot holders to match isn't that pretty? And then it's got the blue on the back. Got those. And then, oh my goodness. Oh, th this is what fell on the floor. Well, I'll just, I got three here. So I got by the, uh, Wola, the brand Wola, in the party section. And they were not hanging anywhere. They were on a strip. I almost missed them. Thank goodness I watch other YouTubers. Um, their hauls that way I kind of know what's out there and what to look for um, because I would have missed them all together so anyway look at this this is my favorite it's the the canvas with the or the you know let me open it let me open it from this package here show it to you without the glare so it's got the, the canvas and then the burlap you know look with the little tie there and it's got the white polka dots isn't that cute so there's the polka dot one and then there's the stripe one this is really nice too and then the what would you call that I'm, I'm not sure the print the name of the print but there's that one the red or pink so that that was exciting this these are I was like oh my goodness and again I found these on a trip I was just going to for a certain item at the Dollar Tree and just happened to walk by and say, oh, let me see if they've got them. And they, they did. So it's all a matter of timing and luck at the Dollar Tree. <laughs> it's like a scavenger hunt. <laughs> and then I picked up four of the uh, vacuum storage bags. I like these. They work just as well as the other brands. And if you've ever looked for these at the store, they're expensive. You can pay, uh, anywhere from four to seven dollars for one bag so this is a great deal and they they worked for me um i 
I've used two of them already and they have the air has not um, gotten in the bags. They're still sucked up and the way, you know, they're intended to be. So it's great for storage because it makes a lot more room. So I did get four of those to keep. They don't always have them. That's why I got four um, just so I can stash them away when I do need them because a lot of the times when I'm looking for them, I can't find them. So they stock them and I grabbed four. Yeah, I was being a little greedy. <laughs> and then look at this. They've got their school supplies out. Oh my goodness, I love this color green. So it's, it's got the folder with the little pockets here and then it's got a zipper here. Let me see how easy it is. So open. Oh, there we go. So it's got the zipper there. You can just stick receipts or an important paper, you know, so, you know, a little reminder, or you can even put in a little cover sheet for yourself. So yeah, I thought that was really neat. So got that. And then this, this just got me. The, the, what, the harder you work, the better you get. And that is just amazing. This is the only print that I saw but um, it's just a little journal. I just thought it was really pretty. It's just a little reminder, you know, work hard and, you know, keep at it and you'll see the results. So there's that. And then I got my son a little binder pouch. He loves these, he loves to collect. He collects pens and pencils. And I gotta tell you, he wants to take every single one because he, sometimes he goes to the day center. He's, um, he's handicapped. So, he loads his bag, his backpack, so heavy. I mean, it, it, it has knocked him over before because he's a little off balance already. But he wants to fill these things up to the rim. But anyway, I'm rambling, getting off topic. So I did pick him up another one of these. And this one's really nice. It's a, a very nice quality. It's, it's nicer, in my opinion, than the ones that they've had in the past. And who's this by? This is by Unison. Let me see who's who. I don't think it's a green briar. No, it's not a green briar. It's by Unison, uh, and it's division of Fibro Source USA Incorporated, San Diego, California. So yeah, it's very nice, guys. It's the the quality is much nicer than the ones that they've had in the past. So there's that. And then, oh, goodness, look at this. Oh, I fell in love with this. I did pick up two. So they're, they're file folders, and there's three in a pack. I'm going to open it for you to see see if there's little pockets in, inside. It doesn't say. So let's see. Let me get this open. So it's front and back. And so there's no pockets or anything, but you know what? I can make little pockets to put in there if I wanted to. Look how cute that is. I just think that is so pretty. So I did get two of those and I do have a picture that I'll insert uh, right about now of all the other designs that they had. I also picked up this one. Isn't that pretty? So, yeah. I thought that was pretty. But this is my favorite. So I did get those. They have these, the Surefresh out right now. Um, these work fine for me. The lids are not great, but you know, half the time I send these, uh, you know, with my kids or, you know, I, I just want to put them in the freezer. So they work okay for me. But anyway, they've got the, bonus pack out right now so you get three for a dollar instead of the two so I did pick up uh, you know two different sizes there I got those and then for food this is um, this is the only flavor they had but my watermelon the watermelon one is my favorite but this is good too I like the pineapple it's the hint water if you haven't tried it give it a try it's it's very subtle the flavor you just, it hits the back of your throat or the back of your tongue, or at least for me, and it's really, really good. It helps me um, stay hydrated and, 
you know, if you don't like just plain water, give it a try. I mean, it is a little more expensive than the regular waters, but you know, just for one a day or something like that is, is, is okay. And then if anyone's tried this, let me know. I, the, it's called Kendall Farms Cream of Chicken Condensed Soup. Thought I'd give that a try. So is this, is this by Greenbrier or is Kendall Farms a Greenbrier product? Yeah, it is. It's Greenbrier. Okay, this is a Greenbrier product. The Kendall Farms must be a label of Greenbrier. So I did get that. And that was all for food. Oh, this, I could smell it when I walked by. Look, they have the reuse it little solids there. So, oh my God, it smells so good. This is the Forever Raspberry. Amazing. So I did pick up a few of those. And then I also love this one. Oh goodness. This one is odor neutralizing pure breeze pet. Whoa. Almost almost threw it at you. <laughs> anyway, it wouldn't be it wouldn't be one of my videos if I didn't throw something, drop something, trip over something. But anyway, I, I can go on and on about that. <laughs> I repeat by, I found another purple. I was so excited. So I did get another Dahlia. Isn't that a beautiful purple? I just love that. So I got that and then I got some more of the flocking balls. This is the navy, the red, and the off-white or yellowy white. I think this is a yellow. No, yeah, this is yellow. Yep, got that. And I don't know how that got in there. I'm working on a, a Christmas in July project. So a little scraggler here. <laughs> and let's see, moving on. I picked up some washi tape and this is the little dinosaurs. I just got that. I thought the kids would like to play with that. And yeah, I thought that was cute. So I got that. And then moving on to toys, I picked up some light up tops for the boys that are coming over today. So yeah, got that. Oh, while I'm thinking about it, I'm gonna have two of my older grandsons coming to stay a week with me. I'm having a great granddaughter soon. So my daughter is gonna fly out to Florida and uh, meet her new granddaughter. So I'm gonna have the boys, so I might do a the oldest boy, uh, Andrew, he loves to cook. He is going to be a chef. I know it. But anyway, I think we're going to do a cooking video together, uh, video. So that would be fun. You all can meet my um, oldest grandson, Andrew. And yeah, I just thought I would announce that because that's going to be something we're going to do while they're here. So anyway, okay. Sticking with the toys, I got some noise putty. They're the uh, little, little, uh, blah, blah, blah. Can't talk. Got excited. <laughs> I got excited for the boys to come. Anyway, this is called noise putty, and the littler grandsons are coming over today for a sleepover, so I thought that would be fun to play with. Yeah. Noise putty. <laughs> and, okay, I think, oh, and then they, Love these ninjas. They love to throw them up on the ceiling and they stick and uh, we have to lift them up to get it down. That's just one of the things we like to do here. So I did pick up two packs of those and that was it for the toys. So, oh, little stragglers here. I got some Sure Sense Berry Blast. Now it says it fits the air, air warmer, uh, oil warmer. So I'm going to see if that fits. I mean, it's berry. I love that scent. So I did pick up two of those. Um, has anyone used these? Do they really fit the air wicks? Um, let me know down in the comment section if you have. So I did get those. And I picked up for my Christmas in July project, I picked up some of these self-adhesive hooks. I'm hoping that these come off the wall with no problem. I may just use these hooks with the um, 
the command strips in the back. You know how they get, always give you extra when you buy a pack. So I did get those. And then this family, this icon, I just picked up another one of these. I tend to use the family more in my DIYs um, for some reason. I don't know why. <laughs> so anyway, I did get those. And then look at these. How beautiful. They've got these wreath charms. And it's got the wire in the back for you. It even gives you the wire. And look how pretty that is. I think I'm going to try and make a wind chime out of these. So there's the spring. With the flower wreath around it. And then there's the bouquet. And then there's blossom. A butterfly. And then hope with the roses. Isn't that pretty? So I did get one of each of those. And that was it for my Dollar Tree haul today. It was not a lot, um, but it was some good finds, I think. So anyway, I hope I gave you some insight into what is coming to your Dollar Tree or is what, what is at your Dollar Tree. Um, you got to get it while it's there. I, can't, I cannot express that enough. You have to, if you see it and you like it, get it if you can because a lot of times it'll be gone and you may never see it again or it may come back, you know, you might get a surprise in their back. But for the most part, a lot of times they, they don't come back. So... Anyway, thank you all for watching, and if you liked my video today, can you give me a big thumbs up? It really does help me get noticed on YouTube, and subscribe if you haven't. I would love to have you as my a part of my YouTube family, and yeah, share if you can. Share it on YouTube, uh, I mean on Facebook. I don't have an Instagram. I'm thinking about maybe um, opening up an Instagram um, just to do a little short videos to show, um, you know, the, the new fun finds that I find at the Dollar Tree. So anyway, thanks again. I'll talk to you later. Bye.